Yeah, good. Have you seen this? Only about 20 times. It's useless. Can't see anything. I have plants in the way. Exactly, Leland. That's my bank. I know that lobby. That ficus tree has been sitting in the corner for 10 years. It's never been moved until today, this morning, before the gunman came in. Somebody moved it in front of the surveillance camera. Before the robbery? Also, the Russian went out the back door and the alarm didn't sound, so somebody disconnected it. Yeah, that one we caught. Yeah. And there is a gate out back at the end of the alley. It was unlocked. Somebody unlocked it. So the Russian's not alone. He's got an inside man. If I can find the inside man, he'll lead me to the Russian. And the Russian leads me to Trudy's bracelet. Trudy's bracelet? I should have known. So I got to get into that bank. I got I to gotta have a look around. Well, Monk, you just can't go hang out at a bank. It's a place of business. People don't like it if you just go and hang out in their office. Maybe they need a security guard. You know, after today, I bet they do. Looks like you're gonna get to wear a badge again. Maybe. Well, who is it? Whoa. Don't tell me, let me figure it out. Next in line? Her, the pregnant woman. It's always the ones you least suspect. Gloria Morales, good guess, but wrong. No, she's not strong enough. The inside man had to move this ficus tree to block that security camera. What about Madge? Same problem. She couldn't move the tree. She's got a bad back. What about him? He looks pretty strong. That's Leon Harrison. He could probably move the tree, but he's too short. Too short? Yeah. The inside man had to trip the breaker to disengage the alarm. It goes to the back door. The junction box is behind this cabinet, which is bolted to the floor. I tried, but I, I, I just can't reach it. So the inside man has to be taller than me. Hey, what about her? She's pretty tall. Tiffany Preston. It's her, isn't it? God, kids today. You know, I blame the parents, no, really. No, Natalie, no, it's not her. She is tall enough. But the inside man also had to unlock the back gate. Tiffany just started working here, so she doesn't have that key. Yeah, but that's everybody. There's no one left. Not quite. Mr. M, anybody miss me? <laughs> I didn't think so. You remember Peter Curley, the branch manager? Three and a half hours, that is a long lunch break. Natalie, you see that blue ticket? That's from a parking garage. Why would he use a parking garage? He has a private space right out front. Oh my God, the back of his neck, it's sunburned. So? He just bought a car, a convertible. He didn't want anybody else to see. He's strong enough. He's tall enough. But he has the key to the gate. He's the guy. You're the guy? Look at you. Oh, Mr. Buck. No. That's, that's enough. <laughs> oh. It's jungle out there. Disorder and confusion everywhere. No one seems to care. Well, I do. Hey, who's in charge here? It's jungle.